the Traxxas Bandit build is almost done. Um, all I just need to do is to uh, get an ESC um, mount for that VXL and um, a battery holder because I don't have one in, with me at the moment and a body obviously and the wing but um, here's a little quick run just a little demonstration so far it's off a of 2S LiPo um, so yeah fortunately I can't go full speed because you know this is a small room and I'm not gonna take it outside until I get all my parts out but it's working pretty good <laughs> this is hard. I'm just gonna show you a little quick tour of it. I'll go more in depth on another video. So what you're looking at here is essentially just a Traxxas Rustler. But I did say it's a Traxxas Bandit, which is true, because the buggy version of the Rustler is called the Bandit. Um, and this chassis is a Rustler chassis, technically. Um, the rust, this was actually, this chassis right here was just an extra chassis. That stampede right there was originally the this chassis. And then I just bought a chassis for the stampede. And then there you go. Put some big tires in it. There you go. I got a stampede. That's my other rustler over there. And that's my slash. With this, this completes the Traxxas two-wheel drive lineup. So... Just a little quick tour of this thing before I end the video. I'll make another video showing you guys more in depth, but this one's just going to be just a quick little video. So, Valenion VXL 3S ESC with the Valenion motor. And um, I got Proline front and rear tires. Um, the these are Proline 4 ribs, and I don't know what the model these are on the back, but it does have the Hoosier brand on it, so I believe this is a licensed, licensed uh, design. And they are running on Proline wheels as well, and um, running a Traxxas TQ radio system, as you can see, straight off of my... Uh, Nitro Wrestler. I will give a, the Nitro Wrestler another controller. And, um, let's see. Uh, a Metal Gear Servo that I bought from Amazon um, weeks ago. Or not even weeks ago, months ago. Uh, what else? Oh, RPM front suspension arms. And, uh,. With a thousand weight shock oil on the bottom, so yeah, and uh, not shock oil. Um, I have a uh, hundred weight shock oil on both front and rear, so yeah. Like I said, I'll go more in depth on this one uh, on another video, but uh, hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll talk to you guys again soon.